Good <coughs> morning, fans, Privateer FX. Coming at you on the Tuesday. Still summary markets here, uh, but we're getting ready um, for the big push, which we think is going to start uh, perhaps the end of this week, beginning of next week. Uh, took a little bit of extra time on the bicycle this morning out in the hills here in uh, Switzerland. Beautiful, beautiful morning to ride. Wow. But as we uh, sit down to get started, uh, let's just take a look. Euro came back yesterday. Uh, weaker dollar is now back in play. 117, the figure held. Now we're up here at 75. Looking for some sort of sideways congestion here. Um, you know, really the big, big support is 115. So we're really kind of in just the top third of the recent range. There's nothing much to do as far as new trades here. Cable, same exact chart. Dollar Swiss, same exact chart. Dollar yen less so. It did look like a turn bar yesterday. We had our offers up here at 60. We did not get filled. Uh, trading down at 03 now. Dollar yen's been a bit more stubborn. You got to wonder if this... Um, this this merger or this purchase of Marathon Oil sold their gas stations to 7-Eleven. Japanese company, you got to wonder if there's a little bit of that flow going on here. Uh, I don't know. Been a bit lazy uh, researching that, but um, dollar yen's been a bit stubborn. Euro yen, relatively bid, uh, but not doing too much, sort of top end of the range. Dollar czar is of interest to us. We did not chase it yesterday. Uh, it's now 100 handles off the 1630 lows. Looking for some consolidation. But we feel pretty strongly as things heading to 20. So we need to either put some structures on today or get long some of this shit. Um, we've been a bit lazy lethargic talking about dollar czar higher every day but not really taking action the way we we should be but it's a double-edged sword right you have this summary market bullshit uh, so you don't want to plunge into shit uh, but then you have you know these wake-up calls right I mean that's a five percent move in dollar rand from the lows so we're going to sit down and, and do some structures today, get some ideas, firm ideas down how to how to get long that stuff. Aussie rates last night, I didn't even look. I'm sure nothing happened. Um, you know, a bit of a bounce from the lows yesterday. This is, this is a sell for us. Uh, maybe up at 50. A little double top up there. But um, this bar here uh, on the 31st looks like a turn bar, top of the range type of deal. So you want to be short Aussie going forward. Uh, that also means you can be long Euro Aussie. Interesting highs here now, right? 165.50. That's sort of a, uh, a must trade level now for, for guys like me. Aussie Yen, been stubbornly doing nothing. We have friends who are, who are short this, so we're hoping it goes lower for their sake. Um, this trend line is now moderately interesting. Uh, are we going to get above 85? I don't think so. Uh, is it annoying that we're at 70? Yes. Uh, keep an eye on that trend line. Uh, keep an eye on stocks, obviously. Kiwi, 65.90 uh, was the pivot. We got below that somehow uh, yesterday, all the way down to 77. We like Kiwi lower as well. Kind of the same trade as Aussie, so be careful on your value at risk. Dollar CAD. Less convincing. Selling CAD right now does not seem the, the way to go. Um, in fact, 
downside CAD dollar CAD looks much much more interesting. We got CAD rate. Uh, we got CAD uh, employment on Friday. That could be the trigger. Gold just bid. Higher lows, higher highs, higher lows, higher highs. Uh, if you missed it, don't chase it. But shit is bid. Stocks also uh, just quietly bid in sort of a bullshitty way, uh, carried by like Apple and Microsoft and Google, whatever. Our focus is 3330. In fact, we're going to go 3333, the quadruple three. Um, conviction sell area up there for us. Hopefully, we do a little stretch day up there, but even if we don't, it's just close your eyes and sell on this gap fill here as far as we're concerned. Bitcoin, we've been dollar cost averaging in Bitcoin, um, just tiny little amounts every Monday. We've just been adding a little bit of Bitcoin. It's epoxy way to trade. Uh, it's more of an asset accumulation type way to trade, but we like Bitcoin higher. Um, the volatility is annoying. Are we going to have some sort of plunge back down to 6,500 at some point? Probably. So get your mind right. Get ready for that. Um, don't leverage. Treat it like a stock. Bitcoin is a stock. It is not a currency. Don't leverage Bitcoin. Are you listening, people? If you're not, I don't care. Um, dollar max interesting highs up here 2270 um, less clear dollar max and, you know our horse is dollar rand as far as the sort of emerging guys uh, but dollar max looks the same some big big up days recently finally crude it's like a dick in a box why did it trade up to 4125 yesterday I mean ridiculous we actually sold between 95 and 05 I think we had an 03 average but we just got tired of it and scratched it um, but like what what was up with this I guess everyone was short but crude's back above 4050 I don't think it's going to remain above 4050 for long uh, but it just did a slippery slutty crudy move up to 41.24 I think you guys have heard me say this before why the fuck do I trade crude anyway NASDAQ 11.060 we did trade up to 71 we are dancing around up here sure does not look offered uh, but I sure would not want to be long this shit what to do what to do uh, you know there'll be sellers between down below 10, 300. Uh, that's like 7% away. Could be long up here on sort of sort of a momentum style deal with a tight stop. Uh, but buying greed momentum style, so buying risk on momentum style is much less effective than uh, selling fear. So just be careful keep that in mind as you can see there's not much on the frontal lobe here we're gonna really drill down on this um, dollar dollar czar chart this dollar rand chart and um, we'll be patient with ES right still got another 40 handles top side and if it turns downside you know you can start obviously 3190s is your number so patience patience is the trade today patience like patience at a medical center also patience in trading be patient patience patience au revoir bye 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 bye